something I've been getting a lot of questions on is like what shoes I've been wearing. Um, guys, these things I've had for a while, probably since October. I had originally filmed a video for them when I first got them as like a review. Never got around to putting it out or anything. I just felt like, you know, these shoes had been out for a while when I did get them. So like there's no point in reviewing them because people already know about them. But as I search, I don't see so many reviews on them. Not as much as I'd like to see. But guys, New Balance is killing the game right now. So these are the New Balance Fresh Rum Cruises. They came out a while ago and they keep doing new iterations on the, v these are the first versions, but they've had like a hoodie version that's like all hoodie material. They've got a knit version. They've got this version, which is like the knit. They've got just like a regular tennis shoe version. So many versions, so many colorways. Like this is, you got the, the gum rubber bottom, the leather tag and the gray, but then they have like all gray and all black. And then they've got pink and rose gold and mercury red uh galaxy blue whatever you want to call it their colorways are they're all really neat looking they got a multitude of colorways and these things are super comfortable and not only that but they're like 39 to 49 dollars on amazon depending on the colorway and the size that you get and you can get them in wide sizes too in case you have big feet but these things are amazing the grip's great it's been lasting me a long while i wear these these are my dailies so i wear them everywhere unless i'm lifting like a heavy lift where I need flat shoes like Vans or something, then I wear these to, to work, to the gym, just all around, to grocery shopping. I thought that this knit is like really light and thin. It's just like a single layer there. It's like a sock. I have honestly thought that I would tear it by now. I haven't torn a hole in it yet. There's some strings that get caught and like pull out, but it hasn't affected the overall look of it yet. This right here is their fresh foam and it's got 3D cuts in it so as to cushion your steps with like different pressures in different areas of your foot so like on the inside it's all convex and the outside's concave hexagons uh these things are amazingly soft and comfortable but it's not just cushiony and soft it's also very responsive so like with me i do not like the adidas ultra boost they're nice but they're too squishy, they're too soft, and after a while you feel like you're sinking and your feet get like a numb, tingling, tired feeling because they're just, it's too soft, it's too plush. These are nice, soft, and like plush. As you can see, there's like a lot of crease marks on there, but they're also responsive and pop back, so it's not like the softest ride in the world, but it's so nice, like you will you can walk miles. In fact, I just walked all around Frankenmuth, Michigan. I did not have a single bit of foot pain. I wear these eight hours plus a day at work, standing all day at a pharmacy, retail pharmacy, walking around, do not feel any foot pain. This back's like some sort of, I don't know, neoprene back, and it's got these pads on the inside that lock it down on your heel, but also cushion around your ankle and stuff. That's really nice. Uh, this tag's really nice and cushioned and padded. It doesn't rub around. It's got this soft felt stuff that keeps it from rubbing your ankles and feeling weird. These nice leather tag just adds a little bit of class to it. The pull tab's great. You can just, I haven't tied these once since I got them. You just pop them on, pop them off. This is all knit. You cannot wear these outside in the rain or when it's wet because your feet will be soaked. I mean, water just goes right through these things and so does air because they're super breathable. Um, like I said, this grip is like a gum rubber bottom. It's super textured, super grippy. I've not slipped in these once. I love them. I love them. This is like this fresh foam is so awesome. It's my favorite um, foam technology, cushioning technology um, as of yet, you know, right now, lately. I uh, love it. It's so firm yet squishy and responsive. And it's just, it's the complete package all around. These are great. You can run them if you want to. I wouldn't recommend it. I don't think they have the support for it. And then they got this nice like suede saddle that locks around your foot and keeps it locked down and is super soft super lightweight like you can barely feel these on your feet super comfortable it's like a sock these things you know 4.5 out of 5 i'd say just because they get really wet really easily but for what they are these are amazing shoes i love the new balance fresh from cruise v1s i don't like the look of the v2 so if i get these again i'm going to get the v1s again but these are awesome shoes my friend nick casa turned me on to them you know i really thought new balance was dad shoes for a long time but they're really stepping up their game and the fresh foam is doing that for them i think that's it's an incredible shoe i've had like you know i showed you guys the zante pursuit and the uh i've got the fresh foam rove is their new one that's coming in here soon so that's going to be a new shoe to talk about too so Hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys take it easy. Stay natty. Team Natty out.